But if she's right, hey everyone, welcome back to Wolfenstein, the new Colossus, part 10. Time to help out Kitos, Captain Blaskovici, stay on the platform. Should check out this Enigma machine everyone's so jazzed up about. What Enigma machine? Ritva Chubivara. Grace told me to organize the storage bay by the moon pool. It's been in shambles since the Ausmercher attack. But although Vitun entrances are blocked by debris, can't even get in there. Come with me and clear the entrances. I really don't want to let Grace down. This whole day has been from us. I know you have extra sisu from your ramshackles contraption, so hopefully you can find a way to ram through the debris. What debris? Are you kidding me? I did it. Are you proud of me? I did it again. You can do it, Captain Sisu. I did it. Stupid crate. I did it. Ihana, Captain Blaskovici. Just have to figure out how to get this place organized. Thank you. Thank you for your help, Captain. I wonder if Craze will let me build a sauna in here. Why would you want a sauna in here? That's one weird character. Contraption upgrade. Ram shackle, rambog, tackle through certain walls, obstacles, and enemies by sprinting. But what did I upgrade? Cannon arm. Sturdy, no more falling to ground from blast waves. Cannon arm, throw a hatchet and grenades. Oh, was it this? Mechanic. Regenerate armor. Oh, yes. Let's go up. Holy crap, how big is this thing? It's like one, two, three, four floors plus that thing above. Holy potato. Wait, do we need to see Grace? Hey, Gabriella, the propaganda broadcast. Did you trace the signal? Heinrich Müller. What are these pictures? Killing board. Oh. Jürgen Schlüsser. And who's this guy? What's up? What's up? Hey, Anya. Oh, William, I wish we could spend some time alone, but we're so close to New Orleans. I just hope it's not too late. So... Roswell... What do we have to do? That one's locked. What's here? Farmhouse, film set district. Why are they locked? Nuclear Bunker District. I think I was here. Oh, you can unlock upgrades. Okay. Ah, oh, let's go. Talk to Grace. Exit level. Let's go. Grace! Grace! This motherfucker, don't waste Abby on break your idiot neck. I got you, the New Orleans dossier. I'm sorry. It's just that it took me hours to put her down. Okay, let's roll. 
In other news, the Minister of Public Security, General Engel, has resolved to clean up the streets of America from, quote, all criminal and terrorist elements. Der Terroranstalter Roswell war ein Weckruf für das amerikanische Volk. <laughs> Later tonight, we interview Lady Helene herself about the upcoming movie, the most expensive in cinematic history, chronicling the hunt and capture of Terror Billy. We will ask director Lady Helene the most pressing question of all. Who will play Terror Billy? Can any actor truly channel the pure evil of one of history's greatest mass murderers? The helm. Five minutes. My brothers and sisters. For a long time, I heard through the grapevine about this resistance leader named Horton. Horton? Horton. Ton. Yeah? Windowsill. Umbrella. Horton. Yeah. Horton and his crew are holed up in the New Orleans ghetto. Now, this man has important connections to the remaining fragments of resistance all over the U.S. So, Blazkowicz, I need you to go in there and recruit this man to our cause, you dig? Now, it ain't gonna be easy. The Nazis built this great fucking wall around New Orleans. Heavily armed guard towers, and the coastline is riddled with mines. Impossible for the U-boat to navigate. But you know what? Fuck them. Because we got something else. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did you need this boat? Yes, motherfucker. <clears throat> Anya, tell me what to shoot, Grace. You and Wyatt will break into the East Perimeter Security Tower located there in Lake Bourne. Deactivate the mines obstructing the channel to Lake Pontchartrain. Then, we sail this boat into the city and bring all surviving souls on board. Hey, little fella. What are you doing here? is counting on us, my brothers and sisters. Okay, so why it's gone bonkers? Blaskowitz, I need you to make it to the other side of the Great Wall. Look for any kind of opening that will grant you passage to the inside of the wall. Hey. Christ, Captain. Not much sign of civilian life from up here. I hope we're not too late. What the hell? I think Wyatt has really gone off the rails right now. <laughs> He's just eating those stickers, probably filled with glue. Okay, we got some commanders to take care of. Hmm. How do I do this? Let's go down here. I have five hatchets, so... Should be fine, I think. Oh, 
yeah. <laughs> oh, that is so stupid. Go in here. I think he's here. Ah! I got some tape, some food, weapon safe. Where's the other one? He's back there, but can I just skip him? Maybe I'd rather do that and just ignore him. Just lagged. How did that happen? I lost a few hatchets, so... Oh, there we go. Yeah, I lost two hatchets, damn it. Where do I need to go? I guess just go this way. There's nobody around. Should have rammed him. Ow. That hurt. You're dead. Took a lot of ammo to kill him. Bastard. Nice. What upgrade? Should get to work on upgrading my weapons. Okay, let's go. Oh, this one's full. Alright, what's next? What the? Where am I now? Do I need to go up? Push open door. Oh, Blaskowitz, head for the old American bank building. That's where Horton and his group should be holed up. Find them. Persuade them to join our cause. The American bank. What's a dollar worth these days? That's not good. I don't want to fight the dog. Can I avoid him?
Those are guards. Yeah, I should probably avoid them if I can. Oh man, they killed everyone. What the hell? What is wrong with them? How do I continue? I gotta go this way. I can't go up. Okay, you're dead now. Oh no. He's coming this way. Two? Oh yeah. Here we go. Oh yeah. Whoa. What the hell? Dude! Ow! What now? Dual wield kills. Uh, I'm out of ammo. That's good. Max armor. All right, let's go. Could have walked through the pipe. Damn it. Anything here? Where do I need to go? Oh, it's here. Ow! No. No! Just leave me alone. Ow. What's back here? Come on, peek out. There we go. What now? Oh, please don't tell me there's dogs. The big easy can't undo your tragedy, but I can punish the people responsible. Ow. I gotta go through the bus. Okay. Detainees. Today is the inspection day. Inspection teams on behalf of the Ministry of Health are working in the area for your safety. Stay calm and do as you are told. You will receive food and water after the inspection. Have a nice day. Oh, 
I love the suppressor. Detainees, inspection day is here. Officers will inspect you for lies and disease symptoms on behalf of the Ministry of Health. This is for your own oh, benefit. No. Please comply with the officers or you will receive free food and water. Have a nice day. Oh, this is so good. The armor piercing. Oh, yeah. It saved my life. Oh, let's take this. Looks like I got a shortcut through this building. Anything else around here? No. Let's go. Should I go up here? Maybe there's something up here. Oh, more commanders. Okay, last bullet. That was close. No! No! No, I was about to kill him. Come on. Why? Ah. Oh, he's training the dog again. I totally forgot about that. Damn you, Commander. Alright, now I know where the second one is, at least. This pistol is so strong. Oh, he's above. I forgot he's above. behind all right that's it that's all of them there's guns back here why are there guns back here oh yeah we got some armor oh this is the objective. Let's go. Whoops. Power up crane. Let's go. Looks like I got powered up that overhead crane. What crane? Oh, I gotta go up there. All right, let's go. That's the location the commander was at. Here we are. Activate. William, 
We are moving on from the tower now. Mines are disabled. Wyatt is scouting ahead. <sighs> Just had a big fight with the Nazis. Barely made it. William? Don't know if this is normal, but... I think the pregnancy is making me a little... Uh, <laughs> you know, <laughs> excited. <clears throat> Oh, God, is everyone listening in on this frequency? Yes. Yes. Max Hoss. <laughs> Max Hoss. Good job, Max. Tell her. Okay, new area. Disgusting. Wait a second. Found some armor. I don't know where. Come on, peek. Have an aid. Oh, it didn't kill him. Weird. I don't know why. I got maximum nades. That's how you roll into a fight. Fully geared. Trapped. Looks like I gotta blast my way out. Aha! I knew I could run through that. Oh no! This is the most stupid thing you could do. Drop me in. Oh. Run. Sounds like someone is putting up a fight. Go down. Okay. Who is this lunatic? Ow. Dude. What the frick? And we're back. Hey there, fella. 
Come on, son. Take my Introduce hand. Introduce yourself. You a preacher? No, this. Lord, Lord, I picked these rags up off the streets. Name's Horton. William J. Blaskowitz. Blaskowitz? Terror belly hellfire, son. Ain't you supposed to be dead? I recovered. Well, terror belly don't mean to be rude, but what's your business around these parts, apart from saving our sorry asses? I'm with the Chrysal Circle, and we're starting a revolution. Are you now? Now this here is the last remaining haven for the cancerous growth of independent free thinkers, spreading all over the South and yonder. Oh, we be the outcasts, the poor. Well, everyone who ain't part of the American goddamn bourgeois. That man right there, getting yourself a drink, that's my old time friend Paris Jack. A Paris Jack is a brawler, a cutter, a true believing anarchist, and a hell of a clair on that player, ain't that right, Paris? Don't like to toot my own horn, except literally. Streets are quiet, Horton. Nobody's... Wait. Yes, streets are quiet. Now that's the professor. She got them eyes, can see a speck of dirt in a cow's ass off a hundred yards. I tell you, them goddamn nasty some bitches coming here, we gonna shoot their asses out, I tell you what. Going out in a blaze of glory, hallelujah! You got a lot of good people here. You should join us. We could always use more good people. Well, how you reckon to start this revolution of yours, Terror Billy? Terror Billy? Holy shit, it's him. Didn't that Nazi bitch kill you? Seems our friend here kind of told St. Pete to go fuck himself. He's with the Chrysal Circle, walking legend. I know who he is. Oh, damn it. Here they come. Paris, I'm feeling a little jittery. Do you mind taking the edge off? Let me see what I can do about that. You know, my mom always said, Never trust a man can't handle his whiskey. So you sit right down, sit there, Billy, and drink up. Ugh. What in the world the fuck is this shit? Old Horton special. <laughs> oh, god damn. Now listen, Terry Billy, I respect your ambition. But there's nothing can be done no more. Uh, the world has sank into the crapper, and all we can do now is drink this whiskey and watch the Vortex suck it all down. Didn't expect your belly to be quite so yellow. We've been fighting for a revolution since long before them Nazis came here. We were the first to start building a civil rights movement to advocate equality for everyone. You know the concept of civil rights, Terry Belly? No, you don't. You're just a jarhead, ain't you? Buddy, I laid my life on the line for freedom, justice, and the American way while you and your bohemian friends were passing out Bolshevik propaganda and opposing the draft on every street corner. What good is your fucking equality? You can't muster the backbone to stick up for your people while the coyote's scratching at your front door. We stood up against the imperialist war machine in the United States of America and the greedy money men of Wall Street who was itching to send the children of the proletariat off to die in foreign lands so that they could be filling their coffers. It worked their sons bleeding on the beaches. No, they dress people like you for their dirty work while they's watching the dollars roll in. You're the pawn, the patsy of cantankerous men in marble mansions. Well, I see through that shit and decided not to be a party to it. And yet here you are, guns in hand, shooting Nazis just like me. Difference is you come late to the party. Perhaps your kind had gotten their asses in gear. We'd have won the war. Don't spill that shit on the table, Horton, and they'll lead right through it. This'll get you drunk, there, Billy, you upstanding lackey of the establishment, Jake. <clears throat> Listen, pal, I ain't got time for your horse shit. You gotta make the call. Give up and die or step the fuck up. I ain't wanting to argue with you, Terry Billy. You're too tired to fight. You tired? Man, fuck you! I got kids on the way! And I'll be damned if I'm gonna raise them in a world run by these Nazi assholes! So what's it gonna be, you hillbilly, degenerate moonshiner, Bolshevik and cowards, and goddamn traitors? Lord, Lord, ain't never seen a man remain coherent after more than one shot old holding special. I like you, Billy. Like your gumption. All right. Let's start this revolution. Hit it! Paris been working on this puppy for over a month now. Hot damn. How'd you tame it? Pop the hood, pull some wires, that about it. He's a quick learner, Paris. Always figures out what's what. 
So, what's your plan? You're gonna ride it, cowboy. Yes, sir, you're gonna ride on out there, draw off the Nazi fire, while we make our way down to the harbor with all those who survived the purge. Gotcha. All hinges on that boat of yours showing up. It'll be there. Oh, easy now, easy. There you go, just mind her temper. Gordon, you better get up here. Nazis swarming in like flies on shit. Check, check. All set there, Billy. Now get! Now get. Alright, this'll be it for part 10. I'll see you in the next one. Later!